The Far San Juan Alamo Independent School District is helping students with disabilities get jobs after they graduate high school. Channel 5's Angelo Vargas takes us through what happens after students enroll in the Pathways Towards Independence program. The program allows students with special needs to continue their education and receive certificates from South Texas College. During their class time, they also intern at different job locations. We spoke to two students who went through the program, intern, and now have jobs. Pathway toward independence led us to Irma's Sweet Shop in FAR. Inside, you'll find their newest employee, Janie Gonzalez. Janie doesn't just assemble boxes. She walked us through the start of her day. Like that? And then like this? No. No, not like that? Okay. And so you put all these cookies out here? Yes. What about these? You put these in? I, yes, I did it. Irma Sweet Shop Manager Justin Gonzalez, no relation, works with several students in the program. There's a lot of different things that they can do here that shows them the, the, what the real world is like. Gonzalez wants the public to know to give someone like Janie a chance. They are people and they do have a heart. They do, they are just like us, so they do need a chance to show what they can do because even though they are different from us, they do have a special talents that they can bring to people. This is the same message Pathway Toward Independence Director Veronica Quintana wants to let parents know. Students with disabilities end up sometimes just in the home with nothing else to do. Sometimes parents place them in an adult daycare. From the bakery to the bank. Right here. Okay. Noah Felice is limited in speech, so his actions speak for him. NAFT Federal Credit Union Executive Vice President Dora Gonzalez says Felice started a couple of weeks ago. Thank you very much. We show him a couple of times how to do something and he remembers and he goes about his business doing what he needs to do. Gonzalez says they treat Felice like everyone else. She says he follows the rules and knows what to do. These young people are teachable and they are eager to learn. I do encourage the community out there, the business owners, you know, give them an opportunity. We quickly found out Gonzalez and Felice know they are earning their paychecks. Now I'm doing your job. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have his money, Angela. No, no. No, uh -uh. no, 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 money. You get money, okay. Angela. All right, because you earned it, right? Yes. You're earning it. Yeah. They are also learning the skills that lead to a rewarding life. Organizers tell us they have 30 students enrolled in the Pathways Toward Independence program. Ages range from 18 to 21 and hope more businesses get involved. In the Channel 5 News studio, Angelo Vargas, Channel 5 News.